Let's prove the trig identity on the left is equal to the right. I'm going to start off here by writing the tangent into a simpler form, sine of theta over the cosine of theta, and then just do this over here, cosine theta, 1 plus sine theta. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, I'm going to cross multiply, well, not cross multiply, but I'm going to get common denominators. So what that means here is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take um, uh, cosine multiply through the right term and then 1 plus, cosine, or 1 plus sine theta times sine theta. So what you're going to get is you're going to get sine theta, 1 plus sine theta, I'm just going to leave it factored out like this, plus cosine squared theta all over cosine theta, 1 plus sine theta. And what we can do here, well, actually, I need to multiply this out. Sorry about that. Sine theta plus sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta all over cosine theta, 1 plus sine theta. I'll leave the bottom factored out. As you can see here, sine squared theta, cosine squared theta is equal to 1. So I'm going to come down here. I can write down sine theta plus 1 over cosine theta times 1 plus sine theta. Well, these terms are common. I can cancel them out to get 1. You end up with 1 over cosine theta, which is equal to the secant of theta. There we have it. We just proved it.